Hello, everybody, and welcome to a brand new episode of Pixel Privateers with your host, Mr. Joker. That is me. Now, recently, I did a bunch of episodes with my good friend, Zuljin, and we didn't really go into a lot of the intricate uh, details of this game that makes it, in my opinion, amazing. And what I want to do is have this new series uh, go over a bunch of the details of the game with you. Now, I know there's a lot of... Uh, I'm going to skip the intro because there's a lot of guys out there, a lot of other people have already covered how the game starts and what to select. So I don't want to get into that one. Uh, we're going to go into Riddles. Uh, which is a the group that I started with Zuljin because I've already I'm already pretty far along and we can go into a lot of the details of the game and the campaigns and all that stuff. So let's start off with our crew. We've got a crew that we've hired a few more people, and one of the options when you start the game is you get to choose an extra person. Okay. It, um, Dependent upon your answers. Now, some of them will give you more fuel. Some of the answers will give you more matter. And in this case, I chose one that gave me an extra guy. Uh, also, I want to give a preface here that I am sick. Um, so there might be some coughing. I'm going to try my best to mute everything that comes up. Um, one of the other things that we need we can look at here is as soon as we jump into the crew tab, you've got your, shoot, uh, your ship crew on the left. You've got uh, characters, training, abilities, storage, and then it, uh, there's a higher crew button here. But you have to be at a station to be able to do that. Uh, we'll go back to the galaxy map and I'll show you what I mean. Over here, you can see the little dollar sign up here uh, hovering around the planet. There's a couple other signs as well. And this is where a market station is. And that is where you can hire more people, uh, more items, all that stuff. Now... Uh, I've leveled up a bunch of these guys already, but for me personally, I have been adding uh, more speed so that I can get through uh, a level a little bit faster and have them uh, uh, shoot faster, their their attack rate, if and their reload time. Uh, reload time apparently isn't uh, available on that guy. Uh, this one does. I wonder why Derpy doesn't have it. Does Derpy... He's using the sword, so he doesn't have... He's a melee user, so he doesn't have any reload time. Uh, but for training, you kind of want to focus a lot on strength because the more um, strength they have, the more melee damage they do. And if you're not using melee weapons, it's also still very important because they can carry more. And a lot of the materials that you'll be getting do have a weight level to them. Like this one in particular has 100 weight. 100. So I don't think anybody would be able to carry this. This one in particular goes onto the ship which we'll get into that at a later date because we are not in a place where we can actually go over the market or the shipyard. Um, the guns have all different types of weight. Uh, there's just a lot of things. And it's really important to keep an eye on that. Now on the character tab, you can tell down here uh, we've got strength. And if, if you don't see this, there's a left and a right button that you can go through. Uh, so if I click to the right, you can see my carrying weight is 19.5. My max carrying weight is 33. So right now he's carrying about a little, little over half. Uh, he has no healing power and, and he has no tool healing power. Okay. Uh, his experience, uh, walk speed, all that stuff. And if we click again, we can see the damage he does, uh, and all the other awesome things. Now I've set him to be a vanguard. Uh, I'll just read what exactly what it does. A vanguard, a sturdy fighter who can take a beating and protect others from damage, generates 30% more aggro than other classes, taunts enemies when attacking, making them attack the vanguard instead. So he's really helpful if you've got a really high level. And since this guy's a level 11, it's really helpful. Uh, we move on. We've got uh, a Marine, a sturdy soldier, specializing in shooting of all kinds. So he's just an all-around good fighter. Um, we've got, uh, an engineer, which is really awesome. Uh, they can open locked doors and provide distractions. Um, same. He's also an engineer and we've got uh, a healer, our medic, uh, heals wounds, provides buffs and removes harmful status effects. Now, um, you'll also notice on the far right here. So we've kind of covered all of these. Um, like I said, I go over, I go after strength and speed on a lot of these guys. Uh, agility is important for uh, main hand hitting, uh, hands chan uh, main hand's chance to hit a level 11 enemy, uh, and my dodge chance. 
Uh, dodge is usually what, what you want there. Uh, stamina, your health points, which are very important, and your intelligence. Intelligence helps with uh, tool healing amount, um, ability, let's see, ability, cooldown reduction, and drone and turret damage bonus. So it's really helpful for uh, my two engineers to have a really high intelligence. And uh, you can change out, the cool thing here is you can change out their abilities at any time by switching out one of these items. See this one here? This is a Vanguard. So this is a Vanguard item as noticed by the icon here. And if I uh, remove that, let's check uh, tab, tab two here. I do have a lot of items, so I'm going to have to be kind of careful. If I switch it out with, uh, by right-clicking, it changes him to an engineer, which is great, but in this case, I don't want to do that. Now, we are getting a lot of items, and this one, I'm going to go ahead and load fuel into my reserves. Um, which is down here. And this is all really important. Credits are important for buying stuff and hiring people and paying because I believe we do have to pay our guys. Um, uh, there's fuel uh, that you'll need to be able to travel back and forth. Matter, which is important to travel down to the surface, and research points. Research points are critical for researching new items, uh, which you'll get as we move forward. Um, I've gotten a couple things here. Cyborg boot disks. Uh, can't really do too much with this, but there is an archive, and I'm sure it'll become available. It'll make more sense the further along we go. Uh, now, if we go over here to abilities, you've got all these different abilities that they each get, dependent upon, of course, uh, what their status is. And to go further into this, we're going to go ahead and jump over to the science lab. In the science lab, I know this is a lot, guys. I know there is so much here, but I'm really excited about this game, and I want to make sure that we cover everything. So we're going to start today with crew and science lab, and then we'll go down on the surface, and when we come back uh, in the next episode, I want to cover cloning lab and replication um, and really kind of dive into that a little bit. So in science lab, these are the different factions we've got. Uh, we've got a sniper here. Um, we've got our vanguard, our... Uh, health, our, our, you know, our medic, our engineer, uh, I believe that was, that was our marine, yeah, that's our marine, um, I'm trying to remember what this one is, uh, it is, do, 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 let's see, uh, I don't think I have any, I think I got rid of all of them, I don't remember where they are, but I think they're the sniper, pretty sure this one's our sniper, so I just unlocked that one, <laughs> oops, um, that is the sniper weaponry. I didn't want to do that. Um, I wanted to do this one, but I messed up. So you got to be careful. You don't want to click on it right away. You click on it. Uh, ooh, we can reset. Yeah. Yeah, reset it. All right. So I want uh, this is, I don't know who this is. Uh, I think this might just be a general because I think there's only five. So I think that's just a general group. Uh It'll unlock all these others. Uh, by enhancing elastic fabrics, wearing a light armor increases tool use speed. Yeah, I think this is just for general stuff. And this one, thermal goggles, crew members can shoot from inside smoke bombs. All right, so that is actually kind of kind of sweet. So I think I'm going to unlock this one. Um, and there's tier one, tier two. It looks like we can go all the way up. What? Tier seven. Oh, my gosh. That is going to be amazing. All right. So uh, we earn this, uh, I believe, as we're down on the surface. Uh, I wish I could reset all these. Um, but let's see here. Uh, so I've unlocked all the stuff for the Vanguard who's got shield mode venom, mnemonic shield buffer, uh, optimized xeno profanities. Uh, so he he's able to taunt them a second time, I believe. Uh, AOE effects range increases affect units target. Vanguard's uh, three second longer. All right. And then this goes on to the second tier once you complete the first tier. So um, I'm going to go ahead and start working on this guy. Um, Vacuum bot, 
Optimized automation blueprints. Turrets and drones deal 20% more damage, which is great. Uh, I don't want the flamethrower, but I do want that. Ooh. Did that automatically do that one? I don't think so. I think that just ends it. Okay. So let's confirm that. There we go. Uh, we still got uh, channeled aggression for our medics. We've got uh, impulse powered. We've got a lot of stuff, man. Um, nerve gas effect lasts twice as long. Wow. Um, so these items here will become available. If we go over here, go over to training. No, abilities. Now we've got EMP bursts, which is pretty freaking sick. Nearby electronic devices, cyborg pacifiers. Yeah, see, that's going to be awesome. Okay, so we've got all this. Great. Let's go to our galaxy map and head down to the surface. Uh, we are on this planet, which if we click on it, we can look at the map, and it looks like we've got everything already done. There's a check mark here. Uh, we've got no missions with the company. Uh, also, you'll see that you also notice that a story happened in one of the previous episodes with Suljin where uh, Void Seeker uh, Badar, we got some missions from him. So I'm going to request some missions there and from here. So we've got missions everywhere now. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any left here, but there is one right next to us that seems pretty relatively close. Um, Rowdy Prey, uh, Pigama is an optimal planet for colonization. Go see if it's safe. All right. So we haven't done that yet, so let's go ahead and uh, choose our team. Um, so that brings us to the team tab. And you can only bring, it looks like I can bring eight, which is great. Uh, when you're playing with other people, it's all kind of whoever's first. <laughs> uh, we have low defense, low offense, and low healing, which isn't going to be great for us. But I'm not too worried about it. I think we'll be able to do okay. And down here in the bottom corner, you'll see teleport cost. 53 kg matter, which means it's going to use some matter. So I think we want to try to stay over 100. So when we complete this mission, we'll get a choice of stuff. And that's exactly what I'm going to try to do. Whoa. All right. Um, the mouse goes left and right. Uh, you uh, right click. Someone's shooting us? What are we shooting? Something is definitely. Oh, get that guy, man. Ah, look at this, huh? Yeah, come back here. Kill that. I don't need that. Uh, get that guy. Look how fast this dude is. There we go. Look at that, huh? Yeah. Kill that thing. <laughs> Kill this box. <laughs> Somebody looks like they are invisible. Oh, yeah. Get this dude. There we go. All right. So uh, let's head back over here now that we've got all these guys dead. I'm not going to worry too much. Uh, up in the top left-hand corner, you can see all my guys. i got five of them. And when I hover over it, it highlights each guy. Um, we've got, uh, when they're red, when it starts to have a red mark on it, which we saw just a few seconds ago, that means his health is really low. So you can check to see which guy is really low on health. I can go over here and click on each one, or I can use the mouse button to scroll through. And you'll see the bottom change consistently. You'll also see that we can see our credits and our uh, fuel... Um, our matter and research points. Now, you'll see also this blue line going around everything. That means that they are automatically going to do that. Okay? We can set it to auto use. And if I right click, it'll disable the auto use. But I want to auto use it. Uh, let's go to this guy. He is auto using, um, let's see, what is this? Boost cell division. So this helps heal. So he's automatically healing everybody. Um, it doesn't look like I have any others that will um, help with that that are auto, uh, but I did unlock a few things that are uh, that he will use to help heal. Uh, I don't know why that guy is invisible, but that is pretty awesome. Um, so it's got a multi-bot tool, can't be used automatically. Tool which summons a stationary defense helicopter bot. So that is uh, pretty sweet. Um, I definitely like that. Uh, I don't think I can use... Can I auto use any of this other stuff? It doesn't look like it. Okay, so we'll go to our Marine who has uh, a haste field. Uh, can't use it automatically. Increases the fire rate of energy-friendly entities. Uh, it doesn't look like I've got anything else that I can use 
automatically. Um, uh, a deployable trap which imprisons an enemy inside a stasis field. That might not be a bad idea for another time. Um, he can't deploy, but he can... So some of these guys might be pretty good. Now at the bottom here, 100% uh, the green line is health, I believe. Yeah, the green line is health, and the blue line is XP. Okay? Um, we've got... Uh, I don't know what these are. So hotkey Q and... Okay. So I've got... I believe I've got everybody selected. And uh, we can destroy that. <laughs> because why not? Uh, let's destroy this. Ooh, that looks explosive. Let's kill that thing. Uh, in combat? Alright. They're not going too fast. They don't seem to care. Oh, this guy. Let's get this guy. Yeah, get him. Get him! There we go. Bam. Dead bird. <laughs> get rid of that, too. Alright, so uh, we're going to head into this building. And as you can tell... There's a whole down area. Uh, looks like it's on the side of a mountain. We could only go so far to research. Uh, I'm using ASWD to move around. Uh, yeah, let's head in. What do we got? Looks like it's an old mine shaft. Oh, hello. That's that's fun. Um. <laughs> Everything's going to be all right, guys. Let's just do this. Oh, uh, we called something forward. Ooh, that guy's got a pretty awesome axe. Oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, get that guy. Ow. Get that guy. How's everybody's health? It's looking all right. Yeah, get that guy. All right. Killing it. I'm doing really good. I ain't worried. Oh, what is this? Is this guy? Do we uh? We can't really investigate this, can we? Not really. What is this? Hey there, strangers. Do you have a moment to help a fellow pilot? Yeah, sure, man. My name is Commander Sheen, and I was flying through the sector when those darn cyborgs shot my ship down. I want to get off this backwater planet, but the crash and landing nearly broke my discombobulator. <laughs> Can you help me find a new one? Uh, pointing a pistol at a potential at potential helpers is always a good way of approaching new people. Of course we can. Not our problem. What's in it for us? Of course we can. Yeah, why not? Perfect. The cyborgs store all their scavenging items in storage containers. You might have seen them before. You should be able to find my disc computer in one of those. Once you found the disc, uh, the device, bring it to me. You'll have your reward, and I can be on my way. Deal? Uh, we're on it. We're on it. Perfect. I'll wait right here. Come back when you have, have to when you have the disc computer. Remember, you should be able to find it in the storage containers. Good luck. All right. So we've got a second deal. Oh, this guy's over here. Let's get this guy. Whoa. A little explosion action there with that guy. Uh, I don't know what you are, but I'm going to kill it. Let's get this thing. Uh, what did we get? We got a discomb... No, we didn't get the discombobulator, I don't think. Oh, we did. We did return it. We did get it. All right, well, let's get all the stuff and uh, head back. That was a little too easy, man. Yeah, go talk to this dude. Oh, you found it. Wonderful. Yeah, it was right over there, man. Oh, did you remember to disable the hidden alarm before opening the container, right? Uh, you didn't say anything about an alarm. <laughs> oh, great. Get ready for incoming visitors. Oh, what? Uh, let's switch to engineer. Okay. Uh, uh oh, uh oh. Something's bad. Something's bad. Everybody over here. This guy. Oh, dang it. We lost one. We lost one. Uh. Okay. This isn't good. Uh. This is really bad. Let's click on him. We should have. Where is. 
Multibot. Okay. Get that guy. Somebody shoot that dude, please. Oh, we lost our medic! I'm so toast. Okay. Woo, brother. Not good. Not good. Can I heal, please? Oh, my gosh. How's that guy not dead? He is getting wrecked. He's just blocking. That's awesome. Um, multi turret. That guy's blocking everything. Holy crap. That guy's a maniac. Uh, we have no medic. Can I uh, grab everybody? I'm so host. Everybody come back. Dude, is that guy, like, not dead? He's been pushed back, but... This guy, why can't... Oh, can't be used while in combat? Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Super hosed. There we go. Uh... You are also... Oh, there's a bunch of stuff here. Oh, I'm going to grab this. Can we, uh... I can't use... Oh, can't deploy while cloaked. What about you? Stasis chamber? Can I, like, grab one of these guys? I don't think I can't. Uh, oh, he got knocked out. He ain't going to die, though. <laughs> All right, you. Uh, grab everybody. Come over here. We lost our medic. Uh, this is actually pretty bad. Not doing great. Uh, I want... Smoke bomb, hacking... I don't think they're robots. There you go. Get him! Get him! Yeah! Yes for turret! Yes for turret! Oh, woo! All right. Uh, no, not you, stupid. Get over here. No, stupid. Oh, we we win. Oh my gosh, that was uh pretty bad. Okay, can we uh talk to him, please? I would like to talk to this idiot. <laughs> um, all right, you, everybody's healed suddenly? Uh, resurrect cost. Oh, I can, res oh, sweet, I can right click on him. Yeah, buddy. All right, so it's going to cost some matter a lot. So we're going to need matter when we come back, but. Uh, I can't talk to this dude, it looks like. Alright, that guy is coming being revived, I guess. Yeah, he's getting healed up. I should have done this guy because he'd be able to heal everybody. Alright, so we're gonna get these guys and then uh I'm gonna I'm gonna move this way. I don't know what else to do. Um yeah, get this dude. We're all right. We can keep going. Uh, shoot that thing. Get that guy. Yeah! Get in there. Get this dude. Cool. Everybody seems to be doing all right. Except for the new guy who's not here yet. Oh, snap! Okay, come back over here. Uh, we're going to switch to this dude. Put a multi-bot down. Uh, I thought I had turret somewhere. What is this? Get him. Aha! This guy's back. This guy's in. Can I do this one now? No, he's, what is going on with this dude? Heal up, man. Oh, can I not do another one? 
Cost 20. Oh, double click. There we go. All right. What is this? Uh, great job. You can't even. Uh, you didn't even need the emotional probability ca calculator. Oh, we want matter. For sure. Okay. Let's get this. Oh my gosh, that dude. Somebody get him. Please. Okay. And the rest of you, get this dude. Wow. This guy had a lot of money on him. Oh, jeez. Yeah, get all the matter. Oh, no! <laughs> Running out of space. That's not what I want. Uh, everybody over here. Okay. Uh, let's go to this. Two. Dude, we've got too much stuff. Uh, what the? Get out of here. <laughs> Uh, my ship's for ah, this is the problem. <laughs> I like the cyborg heat mass, but um, let's see. I need to uh, let me realize the weapons. Um, all right, I'm going to disintegrate couple things like this one disintegrate okay um this uh why can't i inject this right now that is crap that's absolute crap all right so i'll just get rid of a couple couple things then so that we can get that matter because i really need it 285 armor 11 armor yeah we can get rid of that Disintegrate that. Um, the five armor. Wait. Yeah, we'll get rid of that. Um, what is this? 68 armor. Dodge bonus. Wait. Nope. Well, that's gone. Get rid of that. All right. How much can I pick up? All of this. Okay. I want to know what happened to being able to build a turret. Is this it? There it is. What about this guy? So I got to put a multi-tool uh, tool that summons a stationary defensive helper bot. Uh, slow field bot. Uh, so I wanted... Do I have to place that down and then I can place down the turret, it looks like? Oh, no. He just has it set that way. The other guy's got the turret. I gotcha. I gotcha. Because of the items they have on them. I forgot. Okay. Well, uh, I think we're going to run over here real quick. Make sure we've explored all of this. We didn't explore under the mine shaft. But this is the end of that one. So let's go back to the ship. It looks like we uh, took care of the rowdy party. Um Over here. Can we talk to him yet? No? Alright, so let's come back to the ship. Whoa, there's still a dude here. Oh yeah, no, he's dead. That's why. That's why we couldn't talk to him. I was going to say, what the crap, man? So we should be able to... We defended the ship. Did we not get a reward? Where'd the guy go? Where'd he go? I do not see him. Uh, bro? Oh, he's hiding. Let's go talk to this dude. Thanks, pal. Let's hope they don't have any more guards nearby. Cool. I didn't forget about your reward. What kind of tool would you prefer? Oh, sweet! Uh, an assault frame for a vanguard. Grenades for a marine. Hollow projector tool for a scout. That's the other one, a scout. Scout has the sniping, too. Assault drones for an engineer. Tissue repair tool for a medic. Uh, I want the assault drones. Oh, dude, it's that's that's pretty sick. Okay, cool. Um, let's look at our inventory. See if I can't. I can't install these yet. Looks like we've got one more spot, and then I'm gonna have to disintegrate more stuff. And we are almost out of time. I want to make these a little bit faster next time. Um, but let's go down. 
Oh, jeez. This is... Hello! Get that guy, too. Seriously? Where's he going? A loot donkey? That was a loot donkey. Uh... <laughs> We had a loot donkey. I don't even. I don't even know. I don't even know. But we're gonna disintegrate a couple things, like uh, this one. Yeah. Um. What's this? Cyborg light suit. Yeah. Do that. Um. More or less disintegrating things that aren't really gonna be helpful, like this one. What do we have over here? We've got a lot of stuff over here. But, I'm not doing those yet. Um, so, let's get out of that. Grab this and that. Okay. Um, what I think I'm going to do. Set up. This right here. And then we'll switch over to this guy. And put... Uh, this one here. And then, uh, let's go down one more. Okay. Can we, uh... Whoa, this guy! Holy crap! Okay. Good. Anything else? Uh, got some credits. Okay. Uh... What we got? Here we go. We gotta run... Oh. Oh my gosh! Holy crap, what the... Oh! Whoa! Everybody in here. Everybody all the way back here. Come on. Okay, uh, we can get that. Uh, I think I've got an EMP. Let's see if that'll work, because I think that'll work on him. Yeah, it did. Get him, guys. He's down. Got another EMP. There we go. Heck yeah, dude. That's what I'm talking about. We are, are of course, uh, out of out of space, but um, sweet. Graviton torch, heavy armor. Uh, alright, let's look at anything else I can get rid of that is not going to be... We've got so much stuff. And I think we're going to go over it next time when I return. Uh, dude, I've just got a lot of stuff. Holy crap. This is amazing. Um, I wish I could install that stuff. Uh, multi-turret would be nice to keep. Uh, we can get rid of this. Let's disintegrate that. A lot of the stuff I want to sell, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. Um, Assassin's Suit of Rejuvenation. Uh, plus 12 healing power. Holy crap, that's really nice. But it doesn't have the armor that I want. I've got a lot of high-end armor, and I don't think I want to keep that. Uh, although it would be kind of nice to use. Uh, let's get rid of this gun. Let's get rid of this gun. It's not a super high level gun and I'd rather get stuff that's good. All right, cool. Uh so we're going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. I know it's a long episode, but I'm glad we covered everything and uh I plan on playing this game as m long as possible because I really love the company and uh the games that they produce. So, uh the links are down in the description below. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys all next time. Stay groovy. I'm out. <laughs>